Playing our ride through Greece, Meteora was at the top of my list of places that we had to stop and see. It was the one thing on our last trip to Greece, like four years ago now, that we didn't get to see. She says one thing, but really her old list was like 50 items long and we saw five of them. So we saw one more off of her 50 item list. Okay, this was like at the top of my 50 item list though. So I told Justin that this was a must see when we came to Greece. Even though it meant that we had a super ridiculous climb out of there to get to the Albanian border, but it was so worth it. We just hiked up here to the monasteries at Meteora. Such a beautiful place. The views from up here are absolutely incredible. I guess there's what, like four monasteries you can actually go six. into? Six. Six monasteries. Um, so yeah, we made it to the first one. We're gonna hike to a second one and then... And down and around and who knows what after that. Yeah. We'll see. Such a cool place. I'm so glad we rode here. Found monastery number two, just around the corner here. That wasn't too hard. But I think everybody else found it too. Because there's a whole line of tour buses that we're walking beside to get to it. Generally not a good sign. Or maybe a really good sign. Maybe it's super epic inside. Who knows? It was a cool place. Yeah, it was the riding really cool. to get there was gorgeous going mm -hmm. over um, Mount Olympus and whatnot. Yeah. And then once we got there, I mean, I was really like just blown away. The place was really, really cool. You, there's so many hiking trails everywhere. You could ride your bike up to the monasteries if you wanted to. I just thought it was a really neat place. And it was very, very picturesque. You had the rock pillar formations with the monasteries on one side of the town, and then on the other side of town is like the big mountains that we were gonna ride through to yeah. leave. So yeah, it was, I mean, you can't get any prettier, really. I would highly, highly recommend. We had a great time. Yeah, it was a nice small park with uh, monasteries up on top of the mountains. Yeah. All right, we're hiking down now on this a little bit treacherous footpath, but the views are fantastic. Such a cool tree! So we have been staying here at this paid campsite instead of paying for a hotel. It's about half the price and we are really, really enjoying it. Like way more than I thought that we would. Um, it's always nice and quiet at night. They have literally everything here that you would possibly need except for a bed. So they've got picnic tables, even propane stoves that you can use. They've got showers with great hot water, um, bathrooms, free Wi-Fi, a pool, but it's not in use right now because it's the middle of October. And yeah, these beautiful views and we've met so many nice people here. It's been awesome. So here's our little setup. We've got our bike over here. Stuff over here, tent, 
And we hung our laundry line, drying out some stuff. Here are some of the awesome views. You can see Meteora. Right in between there, you can see these big, big mountains coming through the trees. Beautiful. Wow, that was an insane climb. That literally took us all day. It's about 4.30. We just reached the top. What an incredible view. Holy cow, Greece. It's amazing. Oh, man.